Louise Kennedy and we're here today in our London flagship store which is based in the heart of Belgravia. When I was in college I think one of the areas of fashion that particularly intrigued me was tailoring. Although women's fashion has changed and softened so dramatically you'll always find I think my first love that tailored jacket reappears in each collection color is key and that's where we start. You might just have an injection of color, but then it balances with a lovely, you know, monotone of either midnights or blacks. And, and that's how we always like to bring our color hues in. You really feel you've got something that's so unique because we spend so much time on how the fabric will look when woven, what dyes best depending on the, the yarn mix. It's always about bringing it forward as a small independent brand. It's so exciting. I always have loved Belgravia. When I came to visit West Halkin Street, I just really was impressed by the calibre of the adjacency, the other stores that were within the area. You're a stone's throw from Sloan Street. It's got a great buzz, it's got a great vitality. I felt it was very right for our brand. It's been a joy to have such gorgeous luxury neighbours. We have Christian Louboutin for beautiful shoes. We've got Irais for wonderful swimwear. Uh, we work very closely with our beauty partners, so Makeup a la carte. Earl Douglas, we have a very long-standing relationship. For me, the Halkins has just changed dramatically uh, from the moment Grosvenor became our landlords. And one of the things I love most about Grosvenor is their attention to detail and uh, their excellence in maintaining the streetscape. And you know they invest each season in planting. They keep the area so clean. If you have any issues, they're on it immediately. They want us to be successful. I'm very fortunate, I think, as a designer, as most designers are in a position where you get to travel to so many destinations around the world. We work with the most exquisite Italian mills. To me, these are pieces that I hope whoever is purchasing will also pass down. There's no reason why there isn't a longevity to these beautiful, unique pieces.